Assalamu alaikum friends, welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm gonna be teaching you guys how I make homemade ajar using very simple ingredients. You guys can use any veggies of your guys' choice. It requires no time, you just have to wait about a week or so until it's done and you guys can enjoy for weeks and even months to come, inshallah. So let's get started. If you enjoyed the video, please like, comment, and subscribe to my YouTube channel. So in a large bowl, what I've did is I've washed and I have dried a few of the items that I'm gonna go ahead and use. I have some carrots, I have some green lemons, you guys can use the yummy fresh vegetables from your guys' garden these days or you guys can use, you know, simply the stuff you guys bought from the store. Now, as you guys can see here, I'm adding some watermelon. There's lots of different ways on how to make achar. This is the most easiest way and it's still delicious. So this is what I'm sharing with you guys. The green peppers are from my garden and, and I was just so excited about this. But like I said, I used watermelon. Just enjoy a yummy sweet watermelon and then reserve the bottom or the peel, wash it, cut it into pieces, dry it up, add it to this achar as well. I'm using some green lemons and limes and some carrots. These are the masalas that we're using. I have some fennel seeds, I have some ajvan, ajvan, I have some kalvanji seeds, I have some salt, some dhania, coriander, some zita, I have chili powder, I have paprika powder, I'm going to use turmeric, and I'm going to use salt. You guys can also add whole cloves of garlic into this if you guys want to, but I didn't add any this time. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and get those masalas and add them to our mixture. So you want to get that whole plate full of masalas. I'll have an ingredient, ingredient list down below for you guys. Just add that all into your carrots, lemons, peppers, or anything else that you guys are using. Just mix it all up real good, making sure you guys all get it mixed through. Now this part's optional guys, but I had a little bit of the store-bought achar. It's like a lemon pickled achar laying in the refrigerator, about one and a half tablespoons. So I just went ahead and added this to it as well because I thought that has some of the masalas and that smell and everything and it'll get mixed through with this. So that's what I did. Now what I'm doing is I'm adding my oil. I'm adding one cup of mustard oil and two cups of regular you know canola or vegetable oil so i think it was vegetable oil for this that i had on hand so one cup mustard two cup vegetable you guys can do all mustard oil you guys can do half and half this is what i had in hand you don't have to be really precise and specific with this all you have to do is make sure most of the jar is soaked up in the oil you just have to wait on it to you know let it age the achar and then once it's in a bottle with masalas covered in oil that's it it's delicious with any kind of oil you do not have to have a specific oil for this even though our elderlies or you know before people would use only mustard oil and of course that'll probably have a different taste and maybe some people like that taste as well but i did not want to make it too strong so i added two cups of the vegetable oil and one cup of the mustard oil so um, after that just mix it all up with the oil and place in a jar and then make sure that most of the achar is completely drenched into the oil and then every day two times a day just kind of mix up the bottle and make sure that everything's mixing through really good so it doesn't get moldy or anything on top now this was about three days after i put the achar and as you guys can see, the veggies have made room, gotten softer, the oil has gone to the top, so that means they're all drenched in now. In the beginning, it was hard kind of stuffing them in, but after a few days, they've gotten all nice and soft. So that's about it, guys. Inshallah, this will be ready in a few days. I hope you guys enjoy my video, and inshallah, I'll be sharing lots more. Please do thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Take care, guys. Allah is.